You've probably seen some of these guys flying around this summer. It's the spotted lantern fly. They've been spreading so quickly, and it yeah. seems that so little is known about these bugs, even as they multiply and spread across our state. 2822 Eyewitness News reporter Thomas Battle has more on the pests from Stroudsburg. The spotted lanternfly is an invasive, sap-sucking insect that was first introduced to the U.S. here in Pennsylvania seven years ago. Professor Matthew Wallace with East Stroudsburg University says it likely happened by accident. So they're spreading mostly by humans, we think. So they lay eggs in the fall, just about now, on various types of structures, including cars and containers, and they can be transported to different parts of the country. That's how the insects likely landed in Berks County in 2014. Now, seven years later, the bugs have spread across Pennsylvania in mass. Currently, there's 34 counties in Pennsylvania that are under quarantine. We know that they're established and more counties get added uh, every year. They spread more northeast and into New Jersey. While the insects are not predators, do not bite, and are not directly dangerous to humans, these pests may cost the country a lot of money for one reason, their food source. So the estimate's in the billions because they do feed on important crops like apples and peaches and especially grapes. So the potential loss is, is high. This potential loss is driving scientists across the Northeast to research the bugs immediately. We're doing a lot of interesting research in northeastern Pennsylvania, and we have some people working with the USDA and East Stroudsburg University looking at their biology and maybe finding ways that they communicate that could help us in trapping them and determining um, what their population numbers are. Unfortunately, there isn't a pesticide or a mass means of killing the insects yet. So until a process is found... Squashing them with your shoes is the most effective. So if you see one, step on it. A seemingly simple method to deal with a complicated problem. Reporting in Stroudsburg, Monroe County, Thomas Battle 2822 Eyewitness News. Wallace also says that we are still in the early stages of researching this species, so there's a lot of work that still needs to be done to find out how to limit the spread of this invasive pest.